Here are the 10 career options after engineering. Number 10. Campus Placement. This is the best option if you don't have any intention to study further, or at least immediately after your BTEC. Apply for the placement offers that are available in the campus, and you might have a job in hand even before you pass out. Number 9. MTech. If engineering is your passion then pursuing higher education in the subject is the top recommendation. With focused knowledge into the subject you would definitely be enhancing your career in engineering field, and would have an edge during job interviews. To pursue MTech studies in the top engineering institutes such as IITs, NITs and CFDI, the undergraduate students will have to attempt and qualify, graduate aptitude test in engineering, popularly known as GATE. Number 8. MBA. Those who are confused about what after BTEC, and those who have ever dreamt of seeing themselves in managerial positions, MBA is the right choice. It's a lucrative career option for engineering aspirants. Fields such as HR, marketing, digital marketing, international relations, sales and more are some of the well-known and preferred specializations. Common admission test, or CAT, is the entrance exam that the students will have to qualify for admissions into, IIMs and other leading institutes. Number 7. Study Abroad. It is also a very good option to study abroad and to get global exposure. Those who prefer doing postgraduate in their respective field and are ready to go outside India can opt for MS, counterpart of MTech, for which they need to appear for GRE, Graduate Record Examination, and TOEFL, Test of English as a Foreign Language, both of which are administered by the Educational Testing Service. Graduate Management Admission Test or GMAT is another examination for graduates who wants to pursue management studies abroad. Number 6. PSU An increasing number of public sector undertakings, current figures stand at 50 plus, today use GATE scores to recruit graduate engineers. If you are technically strong, you can apply for PSUs. It is a great option since PSUs are reputed, provide job security, and the satisfaction of contributing to big projects. Number 5. Civil Services Examination The Civil Service Examination, conducted by the UPSC is not only considered as one of the most admired post in India, but also is considered as one of the toughest exam in the world. For engineering graduates, there is the IES in addition to the Civil Services one. If you feel that a government job will provide you with much better facilities and a safeguarded future, then start preparing for the civil service examinations. Number 4. Diploma Courses Pursuing diploma courses is another alternative which will be available for BTEC graduates. There are a number of useful job-oriented short-term and diploma courses available in India which you can choose from after completing BTEC to add some specialized educational qualification to your resume. The best part of these short-term courses is that they all are available with the course duration of minimum one week to maximum one year. Number 3. Entrepreneurship. Setting up your own business is also a great option after completing your BTEC. It lets you have the freedom to express your creativity and ideas. However, at times it gets very challenging to survive in cutthroat competition coming from established business setups. But considering this as a learning opportunity you can work your way up. Number 2. Government Sector Comparatively easy to crack. The government sector provides many opportunities to various engineering discipline. PWD, SSE, Railway etc. are a few bodies that recruit engineers into government service. You are even eligible for bank jobs in India like bank POs. Number 1. Follow your dreams. If none of the options given above tempt you, then get your dreams off the shelf and follow them. Music, dance, photography, painting or any other talent or passion of yours can be grown and changed into your profession. You may experience some fears and worries, but this is normal. Don't focus on the fear, 
but focus on the dream. 